Alexis and welcome to a productive college day in my life. It's currently 6.55 in the morning, Monday morning. I am tired, but I decided to, to shake up my Monday mornings a little bit and go to the gym. I actually wanted to do this because someone on my Snapchat that I had from school that I had from a previous class from a previous semester actually goes to the gym early in the morning and she takes pictures and it's completely empty and I'm just like, hmm. I want to go to the school gym when it's completely empty because the school gym is pretty nice and uh, I'm trying to get back into working out but it's also really cold outside I think it's like 38 degrees right now and so but of course after a little outfit check I have this I don't even know what to call this like because it's like a weird hood I don't know I took it from my mom so but it has these things and it's like the material like this I don't even know what to call the material. I don't know anything. And then I have Gymshark red leggings. Yes, I bought into the Gymshark fad. And then I have some white Converse. I honestly feel so cute in this outfit, but I know I'm gonna be cold. are suggestive that is not empty here. <laughs> I forgot my student ID. Oh my god. Whatever. I'm going to try still and if that fails then I am a failure and I'll just go to the gym at my apartment. actually opened at 6 which is why it was so busy when I got there at 7 so on Wednesday I'll try to wake up at 5 30 and go to the gym at 6 sounds fun <laughs> I'm gonna take a quick body shower and then I'm gonna make some food and then go through my Monday morning routine if you're interested in a more in-depth Monday morning routine for me I do have a video and I put it somewhere in the description in the little thing in the corner i don't know how to do that yet but i'll figure it out <laughs> it's been too cold to keep my plant outside girl is tired. Uh, I'm just gonna show off the fit. I have some boot cut khaki jeans with white converse from this morning. A hundred thieves black t-shirt that I literally always wear. And my dad's jacket that I refuse to give back. I have like three things of his jackets. I, I'm never giving them back. So giving off very boyish vibes? Yes. Yes it is. But it is what I'm comfortable in. There's been such a drastic change in temperature. It is very pretty though, very pretty.
so I'm back in my apartment but I just want to take a second to talk to you guys because I haven't gotten to throughout the day so basically when I got on my first class I got an email from one of my like she's not directly my manager I guess she's like my manager's manager's manager <laughs> she's like up there with like the CEO I guess he's she's below the CEO but her and the CEO who I've actually talked to because it's a small marketing business but I've talked to both of them but she emailed me and she was like oh uh, thank you like thank you so much for all you do for the recaps which is like I write summaries for the different events that um the people do I guess like today was a meeting with like all the other like the people that they work for I don't know it's confusing basically her and the CEO were bragging about me because I did such good jobs on recaps and Florida is the best state for spree caps compared to like I think there's Texas California Connecticut I think those are it so she was just saying thank you and I felt so happy because I thought I was I genuinely thought that I was doing something wrong because in every meeting they talked about how to do recaps and I was like am I doing something wrong because I'm the one main person doing them <laughs> so that happened and then I went to my second class and I guess God, why do people drive so fast in here? I guess today is the Chinese New Year and the year is the tiger and my second class for my buyer behavior class she is Chinese so she handed out little candy chocolate thingies I think this is a chocolate because there were like Mentos in there I was like I don't want Mentos I want authentic Chinese candy so now I'm gonna try that okay Let's see it smells exactly like a Kit Kat oh my god it smells so good okay Oh my god, it is so good. It tastes like this Mexican candy. I don't remember the name of it. But it's like, it looks like a cookie. But it kind of smells like a Kit Kat. But it has the consistency of like, neither of those things. <laughs> that was so good. I should have gotten two. Dang it. Okay, but now I'm going to go into my apartment, make a quesadilla, maybe make two quesadillas. And then at seven, me and my roommates are going to go back to school because the Mexican American Student Association Club thing is having a game night and I really want to play La Loteria because if you're having a Mexican game night and not playing La, Lot La Loteria then what are you doing? Obviously you're going to play La Loteria and if they're not we're going to start right. We're going to start right. I took a nap after eating my quesadilla because I've been up since 6 in the morning so but it's 6.50 right now I'm gonna go to the Amazon locker place because I have an Amazon package. So we're gonna do a little Amazon opening, a box on opening, an opening, opening, whatever. <laughs> and then we're gonna go to the game night at the school. And then I'm gonna come back here and do the opening and then go to bed. <laughs> Just go to bed. So it's 10.30 now and your girl has been up for 16 hours minus my 20 minute nap. So I'm a little tired and I'm just going to go ahead and open my Amazon package and then get ready for bed. So most of this stuff is like not that interesting but I figured it'd be fun to do it anyway. And also look at my knife. Oh wait this side. It's like purple metallic shiny metal metallic I don't know I don't know if you can even see it correctly but it's a dragon <laughs> not open that correctly so I was actually able to get all this stuff because one of the textbooks that I got for my classes what actually wasn't required so I returned it and then used that money to buy all this so the first thing I got it's super interesting trust me it's Nizoro anti-dandruff shampoo I'm not afraid to say that I have dandruff and I have dandruff bad. It's even worse because I have black hair and you can see that shit easily. So I got this hum replacement head so it's like those electrical toothbrushes. I got these little spatula thingies. I don't know if you can even see it inside. Let me pull it out. There are these uh, spatula things that like are silicone that you use for putting on um, face masks so you don't use your hands and you just use the spatula thingies and I always use face masks so I was like why not and then I got something that I should already have like I should have had this 
for years like literal years since like middle school whenever I used to walk to the bus stop like this is how long I should have had this but I've never had it it's an umbrella <laughs> It's black on the outside and it's red on the inside. And you're probably thinking like, Alexis, don't you live in Florida? And doesn't it rain in Florida randomly? Yeah, both of those things are true. And I still didn't have an umbrella. <laughs> the next thing I got is some Aveeno body lotion, non-scented, fragrance free. This one I have is actually really old but it lasts forever. So I just got the big bottle because it lasts forever. And the last thing is what I'm most excited about. And I, <laughs> I've been most excited for this thing. And then I kept dropping the Amazon box. Like, oh, it's not even glass. Okay, never mind. So I, oh, it kind of, I mean, it kind of is glass. Anyways, it's a glass mug and you can't, I can barely tell. You can't really tell but it has, you can't tell at all. Like you cannot see it at all. I'll, I'll put a picture. But on the inside it's supposed to have like a little heart shape, but this is actually like kind of cheap. I feel like I could just break the handle and it's not deep at all. Like, I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm so upset with this and I was the most excited for this. I might like try to find another one, like a bigger size and then return this one, honestly, because this is not it. But with that being done, I am finally, final, final, I am finally going to end the video. It's been a very long day, very long day. So if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and also subscribe if you're new.